What's good, y'all? Today I'm gonna show you how to play Out Here In It by Tracy Lawrence. It's in finger style. Chord you're gonna need is a G, a D, an F sharp over D, um, an A, B minor, E minor seven, and a B flat. If you don't know what a B flat is, it's 013331, ideally, but it, everybody has trouble with this chord, um, in my opinion, because um, they have trouble getting that first string to ring out, but you don't need it anyway. It's real quick. It's in the chorus, but um, so let me show you your intro. Your intro goes like this. kind of messed up a little bit on that intro but let me um I'll fix it so the intro starts on the G chord and you're gonna go all right so what you do just hit six and then hammer on the third string second fret then four two six then hammer on again third string second fret four two six Three. All right, so that's your G. All right, then right here is where you got a couple levels to this. So you can do it like he's doing, like this. All right, and what that is, hold an A chord and go five, hammer on the four string second fret. Five, three, five, hammer on five, three. All right, so that's how he's doing that. My bad. All right, but if you want, if, if you have trouble with that, just do it like this. All right, five, three, four, two, five, three, four, two on that A for your intro. All right, so your intro all together goes like this, G. A, G, A, alright, and then when the verse starts, it's going to start on the D, let me play it for you, here's your verse, hold on, my bad, I had the pattern wrong, alright, here we go, D, sharp over D, G, A, D, F sharp, G, A, B minor, So um, let me tell you this pattern, then I'll do it all together again. So you're going to start your verse on a, on a D. Um, the second verse is the same thing, it's just cut in half. But the pattern on the D, the way I'm doing this chord, my first finger's on the second string and middle first, and the pattern on it is 4, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 2. That first string is open, by the way, but you don't have to do that. Sorry if y'all hear the people cutting my grass. Um, and then there's an F sharp over D, same pattern, but do the sixth string instead. Then you're gonna go to a G, and you can put your fingers back in normal position. Six, three, four, two, three, four, three. All right, then A. Five, three, four, two, three, four, three, five, three, four, two, three, four, three. Then you're gonna go back to D. F sharp. G. A. All 
somebody right here, you're going to go to B minor, 5, 3, 4, 2, 3, 4, 3, A, G, and the verse ends on an E, E minor 7. You can just do a strum or just hit the 6th string, open 6th string. Alright, man, that weed eater's throwing me off, but um, anyway, so your verse, now that I showed you the pattern, goes like this. D, F sharp, G, A. One more time, D, F sharp, G, A. B minor. right before your chorus, which starts on a G. D. A. B flat, B minor. A. G. F sharp over D. To, I was hoping I didn't have to do this. Hold on. I got it. All right, so your chorus, I had it right actually, well almost. So your chorus starts on the G. D. A. <clears throat> My bad. B flat. When you get to the B flat, just go. Um, five, three, four, two, on the way to the B minor. A. G. F sharp over D. E minor seven. F sharp over D. So now that I showed you that, let me just do your chorus all the way through for you. G. <clears throat> My bad, let me start over, I messed up. G, chorus. My dog's throwing me off, hold on one second. What are you doing? They make some weird noises sometimes. All right, so your chorus goes G. your chorus you know how to play the whole song now after that chorus you're going to do this again one time like the intro
next verse is going to start right here. It's just like the first one, except for it's cut in half. Um, you're, the part where you go to the B minor, you're just going to skip that and go straight into your next chorus. Your next chorus is just like the, um, the one I just finished showing you. And the only other thing you need to know, there's a bridge. And um, my dog keeps throwing me off, man. If it wasn't so hot, I'd let him outside while I do this. But um, let me find this bridge real quick. Hold on. And I passed it. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Here's your bridge. Fresh in my memory. All right. So your bridge at the end of your second chorus is going to go G. F sharp over D. A. sharp over D, E minor, alright, and then your last chorus is going to start right here, alright, so this little bridge all together goes like this. starts right here it's just like the other ones and then let me see if there's an outro if it is it's just like the intro but hold on So your outro is just like the intro, G, A, alright, then the last time you go to the A at the very end of the song, just pick down through the chord, alright, so if y'all have any questions, let me know, but let me tell you one more little thing real quick, um, if you didn't notice, sometimes I'm playing the whole pattern. So that pattern that I showed you already, this one, my bad. I already forgot the pattern, hold on. I think it was that one. Dang it, I don't wanna, hold on one second. Gosh, this stuff gets confusing. Alright, so the pattern that I already showed you, this one right here. Alright, um, if you want, sometimes I was doing the whole pattern, and he is too. So all that pattern right there was, was this pattern, just missing some, some notes. This right here. Alright, so if you want to do that, it's just on the G, for example. Six three four two six three four three six three four two six three four three. All right. So on the other chords, it's the same thing, but like on the A, it's the fifth string instead of the sixth string. All 
All right, but anyway, I just want to let y'all know that. Y'all can do that whole pattern if you want. But that is and was out here in it by Tracy Lawrence. If I confuse y'all, let me know. Leave me a comment and hit that like button if, you, if this video helped you or anything. Hope y'all doing good, and until next time, gone.